What's up guys? In this tutorial, I will show you how to fix the This unlicensed Adobe app has been disabled error. If you're seeing this message when trying to open an Adobe app like Photoshop, Premiere Pro or After Effects, it usually means that the app is trying to connect to Adobe servers to verify its license, but it fails to check. One way to stop this from happening is to block the app's access to the internet using your Windows Firewall. Start by searching for Windows Defender Firewall in your Start menu and hit Enter. In the window that opens, look to the left side and click on Advanced Settings. This will open a new window titled Windows Defender Firewall with Advanced Security. On the left side of this window, click Inbound Rules. Then, on the right-hand side, click New Rule to begin creating a new firewall rule. In the Rule Setup Wizard, select Program and click Next. Now, you'll need to point to the specific Adobe program that's causing the error. Click Browse and navigate to the folder where the app is installed. Most Adobe apps are located in your C drive, under Program Files, and Adobe. After selecting your problematic Adobe app, select Block to Connection on the next screen and click Next again. You will then be asked when the rule applies. Just leave all options checked, Domain, Private and Public, and click Next one more time. Now, give your rule a name, something like Adobe Inbound Block, and click Finish. Once that rule is created, take a look through the existing list of inbound rules. If you see other rules that are linked to the same Adobe app, for example, ones with the app's name in the title, right-click on them and select Delete. The only rule you want to keep is the new one you just created that blocks the connection. Now, repeat this process for Outbound Rules. Click on Outbound Rules on the left-hand menu and again, click New Rule on the right. Select Program, then browse to locate the same Adobe app executable file you used earlier. Once selected, click Next and then choose Block the Connection and continue through the wizard just like before. Name this rule something like Adobe Outbound Block and click Finish. After that, scan the Outbound Rules list just like you did with Inbound and delete any existing rules related to that Adobe app, except the one you just created. And that's it. Blocking both Inbound and Outbound connections for the Adobe app stops it from reaching Adobe's licensed servers, which prevents the unlicensed error from appearing. I hope this helped you out. Leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.